A family is now homeless after a fire destroyed their home in Wilderness Ranch, burning it to the ground. Now they're doing their best to pick up the pieces while keeping up their spirits. Our Shira Matsuzawa spoke with the family this morning and she's now here with their story. Shira. Kim, Je Jennifer Severns tells me she's thankful for her family wasn't home when that fire broke out because it all happened so fast. She says the only thing she managed to save were the clothes she was wearing and her pets. I think everything just kind of stops, like time just stops for that little bit. 24 hours can make a difference. On Monday, Jennifer Severns was home alone working, but now but everything's gone. The mother of three says she heard a noise on her porch. When she went outside, she saw smoke and grabbed a hose. And by the time I had turned the hose on and pulled it and brought it up, one side of my house was completely engulfed. The windows were breaking out. So I had to run around to the front of the house. Um, and when I went in through the door, the, there was fire rolling up um, through the ceiling, through the kitchen. The whole house was completely covered. In, I mean, it was just been caked in smoke. Jennifer ran back into the house, grabbed her dog and cat, and ran outside. There was flames everywhere, um, smoke everywhere. I actually, it was, the heat had, had intensified and I like took a deep breath in, so I breathed in all of that smoke. And as she ran with her pets in hand, she looked back and thought, I just need one more picture of my house. I just want one more picture of my house before it's gone. And I took that, I took a picture. That was the last time I saw my house. The devastation comes as the family is already dealing with so much. We're already facing cancer. We've, we've got a very sick daughter, um, and now we don't have a house. KTVB first introduced you to the Severns family last year, when Jennifer and her daughter, Jessie, shared the painful reality of what it's like to battle cancer during a special Severns hero. Despite losing their car, Jessie's wheelchair, and cancer medicine, Jennifer says this experience will make them stronger, and they have the support of the community to help them through it. You don't think about how much help people will give you um, in, a, in your time of need, but um, people just came together. It truly touches your heart. What took years to build, gone within minutes. But everything, every bit of that house was, was something that we did. I was just thinking, you know, I, I can't cry about it. You know, I've got my kids. Um, we've got got family and uh, that's that's all that matters at this point everything everything can be replaced and Jennifer says they have no idea what caused the fire right now they're still trying to figure out what to do next she says they're working with insurance and staying at her parents house the Red Cross also gave them one day in a hotel while insurance is giving them two meantime there is a GoFundMe set up for the family and we'll have a link to it in the story at ktv.com Shira, I said at the top of the show, how much heartache can one family take? Right. And, and I'm inspired by her positive attitude, you know, that all of that can be replaced. But I know that all of us in our viewing area, we are giving that family one big hug and we're saying a lot yeah. of prayers for them. Absolutely. Shira, thank you. Mm -hmm.